class is in session, the professor is in, and we have Jacob Fatu of the new Bloodline. And he is an excellent trainer in the sense that silence gems do 75% more damage. Purple gems do 60% more damage. Blue moves are going to start with two more move points. And Acrobat, he is defensive. He does have the new Bloodline link, receive 50% less damage from any color gems. And he has a gear. Multiplied gems generated from moves will increase their strength by times four. But we're not going to have a chance to see that today. But we do have the ability to check out his, one of his movesets right here. He does a he has two 1 MP moves and a 4 MP move. So the Samoan Splash. Make 24 random gems into two turn countdowns. It's going to make six into red gems at the end. The Rikishi Driver is going to decrease. And it says wildcard gems, but it's all gem damage by 75% for three turns. And the Rock Bottom. And this we're going to check out against an actual showboat because he does have a hardcore move so decrease all the countdown gem timers by two <clears throat> and then uh, deal one million damage and increase your red gem damage by 200 percent afterwards we got the 99 mp era here so we are just going to put a whole bunch of red gem damage but to be honest you would actually run this the same way after 99 mp uh, because you'll um, be able to get this all going turn one Maybe a Santa on the back end. Maybe. So let's go without a showboat first, and then we'll show it with a showboat, and you can see what you think. I didn't show you. We have the... I didn't even show the plates of what we're doing here. So we are actually going to put on the head of seance at first, and then we can show it without the head of seance. But whenever you break eight red gems, generate 30 afterwards. And then the heart of Jade, whenever you make six or more countdowns, we're going to increase our red gem damage by 100% for two turns. So let's bro. Boom. Put down the countdowns. Decrease our opponent's gem damage by 75% for three turns, and then we blow up the board. Pretty nice cascade. And then the seance plate goes off. And so that hit 28 million, 36 million total. Three quick clicks. They're going to have a hard time kicking out because of the reduced gem damage. So that's going to keep most people down. But let's... Let's bro against an actual showboat. And then we can see what we think about this. We're going to find a showboat worth showboating with. Do you think Jacob is going to make like gym defense straps uh, very relevant again? <laughs> that moveset? I, I think he is. I think that's an actual thing now. I think people that. So this is basically the um, showdown moveset because you can run this in a showdown because it's one MP, one MP, four MP. So you can double red MP and you can actually with his tag link of 50% gem defense, and then that 75% put some armors with an armor strap on. It's going to be nasty. So let's bro. This is very much a seance build plate. <laughs> build the build set for sure. But we can take the seance off and, and show what other, other move sets can do with it as well. So as you can see, our combo move is going to be working with this one as well. So one, reduce, and now we watch the world burn. There's one, there's not much of a cascade. Second time through, also not much of a cascade. So that did 81 million. So you can see just how much of a showboat assassin that Jacob Fatu is going to be. All right, let's let's show another move set.
All right, we're back with our next move set. We're going to hit the Moon Salt, deal 1.56 million damage, make 30 multiplies into purples, and pin the opponent. He does have a big boot damage, uh, seven, uh, sorry, 490k damage. Choose a 7x2 to swap into Blue Gems. Pin bar will not move, and that's going to be important for the next move set. And then the Headbutt's going to make a 7x1 into Pyro Gems. So that one works as well, too. Um, we are just going to go all multis and purple gem damage. we got the 99 MP right now, so we might as well just play around with that and see what we think. Uh, in terms of uh, skill plates, we've got the specs on here. You can put the Piper's uh, plate on there. Uh, the Pyro plate's not going to do much help for us in this regard. We're just going to have that on there for now, just for the S's and the G's. So let's bro. And let's see what he can do. Jacob Fatu. So with 99 MP, obviously, it's going to be pretty easy. Pyro's along the bottom. Then we're going to choose a 7x2. So we're going to blow up these two rows right here. Everything else is going to turn into multiplies of 13 above and since the pin bar isn't moving so that does another 7 million damage and then we're going to turn all these multis into purples and keep in mind that his gear does plus 4 mp or sorry plus 4 multiply damage so that did 83 million but those would be multiplies of 17 so very easy click 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 boom and what's amazing is that's not even his best let me show you another move set with this so we're back again we're going to do the exact same move set with the exception of bringing in the samoan drop we're going to deal 550k it's four red mp choose five gems to make into blue gems same trainers same multiply everything but this time for skill plates we are going to bring in the smoke whenever we break three or more blue gems we're going to get three purple mp and then we are going to put on the Timeless Style Tiffy Plate. Whenever we activate a purple move, our blue gem damage is going to go up by 250%. And that's going to be devastating. So let's bro. This is broken, by the way. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put down the pyro gems on the bottom of the board. So if you don't have a TIFF plate, but you do have an LA Knight plate, it will also boost blue gem damage. So you can also put an LA Knight plate on here. So now our blue gems have now been boosted. They're at 350k. And so now here's where you can choose which lane you would like to go with this. I would suggest using the red move first, but we can't make a four match on the bottom because of these two blues right here. Otherwise, I would make a four match along the bottom. So we're going to use the big boot. You can use either one. Either one is acceptable. Pin bar is not going to move. Everything's going to turn into multiplies of 13 above it. And that did a 12 million right there. And that gives us three of the purples that we need. And now all you need to do is actually just make one blue match. That's it. You can also leave more blues on the board, which is what I would suggest, but this is just for education purposes, of course. And then we put the pyros down again. And now our blue multiply gems are doing 9 million. And now we do a 7x2, and you can just blow up multiply gems, or you can try to keep this going. This can go over and over and over again if you want it to. It's entirely up to you. Blow up the blues on the bottom. Hopefully you get yourself a red match. We didn't, but that did 72 million. And now there's nowhere else to go but end in the match. So you can see how deadly that could be just like that. We'll try it again this time. Hopefully we'll get a better starting board with it. Wow is right. Let's try this again.
Yeah, this is ridiculous. <laughs> this is bonkers. Yeah, and the, the MPF, the this this is a this is bonkers. So let's try it again. This time we have a better starting board. So the better way to do this is to put these on the bottom row, and then you're going to choose four blue gems on the bottom to make a line break, like so. And that is going to put everything into multis. And now it filled up one right there. Now we can choose a seven by two. The pin bar is not going to move and just blow up with blues. There's more blues up there. We want purple matches if we possibly can. And that did 90 million. And so if their opponent still has life, you can take a swipe of purple and you're all filled up again. Ours does not. So you can just see how nutty that is actually going to be when you get to play it. So, yeah. Jacob Fatu is absolutely a crazy, crazy card for sure. Let's see if there's one more moveset out there.